what the Bible tells us is coming. Uh, a new world order under one ruler, the Antichrist, with one economic system where everybody is linked together, those who join with it and take the mark of the beast. And that will be those who are lost. Uh, like I've said before, don't put the cart before the horse. Some people will say, oh, if you take the mark of the beast, then you're lost. Well, if you take the mark of the beast, it's because you were already lost. Uh, you were lost when you took the mark of the beast or you would not have taken it. You, you are a lost soul if you join in with this one world economic system and take the mark of the beast. You are lost. You take the mark of the beast. You're on your way to hell. And so don't put the cart before the horse. Don't think that it's all about people taking the mark of the beast and then being lost. No, uh, you're uh, only a lost soul is going to take the mark of the beast. And uh, those of us that are born again, that have been saved by the blood of Jesus, we will not take the mark of the beast. We will reject that mark and we will not take it. We will not be a part of this one world economic system because we're not on our way to hell. We're not a part of this world. We don't belong to the Antichrist. The mark of the beast will be the mark of the beast. It will identify those who take it with the beast. And the beast out of the sea described in Revelation is none other than the Antichrist, the end times beast, the Antichrist, who will rule the entire world. The Bible says that he'll rule every tongue, every nation, every people, every tribe, everybody in this world, every nation will be a part of this one world system, this one world government. And the false prophet will be the one who will implement the mark of the beast. And so the mark of the beast is coming uh, and it will be after the rise of the false prophet. The false prophet is coming. The false prophet has not yet appeared, but he is coming. We believe on this channel that it will be a coming Pope. And we believe that he will take the name Pope Sixtus the Sixth. And I've talked about that in other videos. And I encourage you to watch uh, my video on the number 666 in particular. Uh, that's my most watched video and i really hope that you will watch it if you haven't watched it i mean you might want to watch it a second time if you have watched it because in that video i go, I go into great detail about the number 666 about the antichrist and about the rising false prophet who will implement that uh, 666 number so brothers and sisters we're moving rapidly now to the time when the false prophet is going to arise He's going to implement the worldwide religion of worship of the beast, the final antichrist, who will rule the entire world. The image of the beast will be made. Uh, the mark of the beast will be implemented. The false prophet will cause all the lost souls of the earth to take the mark. Uh, but the people who know their God, born again Christians, who have been saved by the blood of the lamb, we will not take the mark of the beast. Our names are written in the book of life of the Lamb of God. Uh, and we will resist the rule and the authority of the Antichrist and the false prophet. We will resist that worldwide rule. We will resist that worldwide religion, the worship of the beast. We will resist that and we will not be a part of that. We will not bow down to the Antichrist and we will not be a part of this one world system. So, brothers and sisters, I want to just close this video by, by reiterating the most important thing uh, that I reiterate many times. But, brothers and sisters, be sure of your salvation. Be sure of your relationship with Jesus Christ. The days are coming to an end. Jesus Christ is coming. Jesus Christ is coming. Uh, the tribulation will occur. The people of God will be here and be God's witnesses through the tribulation. And then Jesus Christ is coming. The Bible says the, this gospel will go to all the world and then the end will come. Then Jesus will return. 